All right, so I'm here with Charlie Vega from Simple Self Defense for Women. And Charlie, we're here in a parking lot because it's a lot of women's fears. You know, Absolutely. you're walking at night, it's dark. Someone can grab you, try to pull you into a car or a building. Same with children. Mm -hmm. So you've got a move we can learn to escape. You say it's all about escape, It's all not about fighting. escaping and not fighting. Okay. So let me show you how that works. Okay. So right now, if I was to grab you and try to pull you into a vehicle or try to punch you, the natural tendency this is, is to I'm just doing. pull away. I'm going to do so this. So whoever's stronger is going to win. So okay. instead of fighting strength, let's show you a move on how to escape. The way you do that, instead of fighting five fingers right now and grabbing you, let's just fight one. It makes much more sense. Okay. So you go in the direction of the thumb. So in this case, the thumb is on top, so you're going straight up. Okay. Now you're going to use your body weight by stepping with that leg going in that direction. Go okay. ahead and go. Okay, so. So just up and, and away. Up and away, you head that way. I didn't expect you to get away, so I'm going to naturally tendency at least fall back this way. that's the way you were going to pull me. Right, okay. so I expect you to go that way. So the idea, again, is really just fighting the one thumb. So wherever the thumb is, if it's up, fine. If it's down, if I happen to grab you this way is down, just you just go, down. Just go straight down. Just follow the direction I of the thumb this. and take a step. And you guys, he's really grabbing me. I mean, my arm is red and I don't have a lot of strength. And you say this is good for older for women, children. Older women, uh, we, we've had a 91-year-old woman do it. We've had children do it. And that's the whole idea is we teach women how to teach their kids how to get away from an adult. Because in this case, let me grab you again mm -hmm. here. If you have a child who's 50 or 80 pounds, yeah. now you're using that weight of 80 pounds or 50 pounds against the thumb when they take that step. So you get more momentum. You that get way. more momentum, exactly. And let's say you're 5'3 and pregnant and don't have a lot of strength, I'd say it's a good move. Too. <laughs> so that gives you enough time to get away. I'm going in this direction. You have time to get away. Thank you so much. The you're website welcome. is simpleselfdefenseforwomen.com, and we'll link you up on galtime.com and show you a couple more moves.